in both areas of both striking and grappling, that is both more of their forte. I mean, they, they, they are all around fighters. So it depends Ladies on who has the advantage in which area. And it's set for three, three minute rounds. First, he's fighting out of the Lord, Lord Properties Blue Corner. He steps into the cage at a height of five feet, nine inches. His weight, 150.1 pounds. He trains with Jim O, and he fights out of Gastonia, North Carolina. And tonight, in the Aries Fight Series cage, he makes his professional debut. His name is Titus Moore. And his opponent across the cage and fighting out of the Knoxville Mortgage Brokers Red Corner. He steps into the cage at a height of five feet, 10 inches. He weighed in at 149.2 pounds. He represents a Gogi combatant and he fights out of Chattanooga, Tennessee. Tonight in the Airy Fight Series cage, he makes his professional debut. His name is Andrew Starboy Sturdivant. Sir, Sturdivant looking big. Yes, he is, man. These boys are huge and yeah. heavy. Some big 150 pounds. Oh, I'm feeling some action starting. Man, here we go. Here we go, man. I'm excited, man. Here we go. Now, starting off in the blue corner, Titus Moore in the red. Andrew Sturdivant, referee, Chris Barnes. And here we go, man. No touch of gloves. No, sir. Three, five minute rounds. Oh, oh, head kick to start off, man. Really good toss of Oga oh, body, body kick. Great body kick. Andrew's looking to take this fight to the ground early on. Going straight to the body lock, really good body lock, really good over on a little bit there from Titus, man. He has that good underhook right there, man. Titus doing a good job putting Andrew against the cage here. A good knee to the body. Andrew doing good at staying low, staying heavy, getting a good underhook on that left side of Titus. Titus trying to get a better angle here on Andrew. That's another really good knee. Now, good job there from starting it, man. Really good job from Sturford to turn it back on the cage. Titus is doing really good, keeping that on the hook. I say Titus right here. Really good job. Sturford needs to stay, keep his knee tight to the cage. It's, oh, really good defense there from Titus. Oh, wow. Oh, man, really good defense. Now very he's flattening him out. Very creative movement from Titus here as we see him take the back. Oh, he Andrew takes the Sturman. back. Andrew doing and it started to return the tool. Very smart. Oh, oh, Andrew. good knee to the body. Really good grappling wow. here. And good takedown there from Titus. Titus doing what he can to establish the side control here as he tries to take the back again for Andrew Sturdivant. Makes that good correction. He was a little high when he came up on Andrew, making that correction. But Andrew not looking too worried about this spot here. And really good job from Titus, man. Really trying to get that hook in. He's got that body lock really good. I say Sturdivant here needs to start fighting the hands. And oh, really good job. Oh, he's trying to he's trying to hook that arm for the rear naked choke. Yep. Sturdivant here needs to start fighting his back to the mat. Start fighting his back to the mat. Andrew doing good at hand fighting here. Good, good for Andrew. Yeah, um, Andrew's uh, he's doing he's doing really good here. He's just staying calm. You know that's the thing about the pressure. There's certain areas you got to be real calm. Here. I'm surprised I haven't seen Titus throw certain strikes in certain areas. You know. Um, yeah, I think Titus is, is putting a lot of his focus on getting that arm around the neck of Andrew Sturdivant. And Andrew's a hard guy to keep down. And he's going to be a hard guy to keep in this position for too long. Yeah, he is. Andrew being smart, trying to get him against the cage a little bit more to minimize that ability. Titus is doing really good, though. He's still threatening the submission, and oh! He's on the chin, not underneath it, but he's got a good crank there on the chin. He's, That's a lot of pressure there. Yeah. Titus is a strong guy. He's got a good body lock here. Andrew is still fighting, man. Oh! Really good job there from uh, Titus to continue to keep switching. What Andrew needs to do, he continue to fight the hands that's attacking his neck, keep his chin down, and start trying to work his back to the mat. 
All right, now that's when you start looking to work your back to the mat, even with the body triangle. Continue to the fight. Oh, oh man, that is deep that under the neck of Andrew Sturdivant. But the angle is not quite what he's looking for. Andrew's trying to make a decision here. Andrew's a strong, strong guy, though. See if he can get out of this. Oh, he, he got, got away! He got out! Incredible, oh. move, incredible technique from man. Andrew. Now we see if the strength and energy that Titus had put into the beginning of this first round is going to pay off for him, or if this is going to be the demise for him going into the rest of this round. That was deep, man. That was, that was Andrew. Deep, man. And you can see he, he might have taken a toll on Andrew a little yep. bit. Oh. Oh, and now Andrew's on top. Wow, great oh, great position man. for Andrew. I think Andrew's going to try to posture up and start landing some strikes. Yeah, we and haven't Andrew, seen many exchanges Andrew so far here in this fight. To, oh, yeah, great elbow there! Good elbow there from, from Andrew. Andrew. And this crowd is going wild here at the Joe tonight. Yes, they are. And we have some good athletes here in the audience rooting on Andrew Servant. We see Trevor Peak. Greg yeah. Hopkins. Andrew here is his guard. This is where Andrew, if he wants to, I mean, so far, Titus Moore, Titus Moore has won this round so far with the multiple uh, submission attempts. Yep. But if Sturdivant wants to steal this, he has to be heavier right here Andrew's, in the ground and pound department. Andrew's still very much in this fight as we're coming to the 20 seconds left of this first round. Yes. Amazing display of uh, just pure tenacity that Andrew showed again and again, escaping the, the rear naked choke at least four times. We try, see Titus trying to set up for a kind of a shoulder lock and sweep, but Andrew being really, really wide on top. Oh, he almost went in for a potential. Wow, what a round. What a round, man. We see a pretty bad cut coming from Ooh. the right eye of Titus. Yeah, Titus is More cut here. a little bit. Yeah, he's cut a little bit. Wow. And uh, from that, el that one elbow, that one elbow cut him, but hey, Makes no difference, man. The person who's won this first round so far was Titus Moore. And, I agree, uh, I agree. Um, I will give Andrew a 10 out of 10 for rear naked escape. Yeah. Not many people could have gotten out of that situation. Oh, it's for sure. The three times that you saw Andrew get out of it. Yeah, man, really, really good round there. Um, overall from Titus Moore, he took it into the grappling aspect. He stayed heavy with him. He got the takedown. He took his back, man. And I'm, I'm for a minute, man. I thought that rear naked choke was in deep. Me too. And uh, boy, did he, boy, did he make a difference? Andrew man. said, "Not today. Not today, Not man." Not today. But now, Andrew has made. Uh, that's the thing about trying to finish the round. He made a big time damage on him that could be vital towards as we continue in this fight. That cut yep. on the side of his head. Uh, we see these guys both kind of equally breathing here. We know these guys both ready for this fight. Andrew smells blood in the water and he's going for it. Titus looking to make a finish and I predict another attempt at rear naked here. Get inside, a good inside kick there from start of it. See if we ex see some more exchanges here. Oh, good overhand there uh, off from strong, Titus. Strong, strong. Uh, Strong strikes from Titus there. Yes, man. Titus came in there really aggressive, man. Titus not having a big frame, but this is a strong guy. Very strong guy for a small frame here. Yeah, really strong guy. And there you see, you know, you see Sturman currently got, having that underhook. He needs to start circling to that same side. But really good job from Titus. So Titus is throwing these knees tight. He's thinking, keeping them tight to the... Oh, good oh, knee. Man, those good knee. Are, are yeah. Powerful. Oh, oh, great timing from Andrew. Wow. Wow. Andrew making himself very hard to make contact with. Titus getting a little frustrated here, I can and tell. Titus got his hands down. I yeah. mean, he's getting a little confident, man. He's getting a little confident. Oh, oh and a, he could have potentially landed in a triangle attempt. Yeah, we see Andrew set up that triangle. Uh, nope, I'm sorry, that was my fault, but still in a good position here for both of these guys. It did look like he fell into a triangle at first, though, from, from the angle that we're sitting. Yes, Titus now with the top pressure and control, man. So far, now what Sturdivant needs to do, he needs to start looking, you cut his angle here and start getting his knee above that elbow. 
on his knee on the bicep, I mean. If he can start getting his knee in the Oh, good elbow there from Titus, man. Oh, potential guillotine. Oh, man. A potential guillotine threat there from Sturdivant. Wow, Sturdivant's looking at oh, the Oh, man. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Created a great scramble attempt here from, from Andrew to get out of a very compromised situation. Titus doing very good at at returning the favor. Oh, here. the Dars. Dars. Strong Dars here from Titus Moore. Oh, wow. really good. Good job there Andrew from Sturdivant. just slipping out of every submission attempt that <laughs> Titus has put in his way. It's incredible. Good Lord. It's incredible. I see Titus going to, like, kind of thinking about setting that up again as he switches to maybe go for the back as we see Andrew tur turtle up and looking for his next move. Yeah, man, really good job there from Titus. And, oh, Titus takes the back again. Oh, and start of it. Wow, wow, man. Good knee to the body there from start of it. We have a fight tonight. We this is a, a fight great, right here, great fight here. This is, I mean, look, I will tell you right here, man, it's been really good back and forth, but, man, this is going to be a, so far I give Titus the slight edge, but, man, if start of it getting put on a really good onslaught in his final two minutes, he might steal this round. Titus having Andrew against the cage here, being very strong, low and heavy, as he goes for a double leg or a double leg attempt here as he's sucking these legs together. Andrew with the head of Titus and underarm. And really good takedown there from Titus, man. That was a, that's a big takedown, man, especially in this in this close of a round, man. It's a big takedown. We've seen this uh, quite a few times. Yes, we have. Lock, lacing the legs, man, yeah. lacing the legs, and this is a really good position because it's going to be really hard for you to escape. Um, yeah, this really enables uh, Titus to be really heavy on the hips, and you know, if you take away the ability for Andrew to to start using his legs, start standing up, which is what he's doing now. Ooh, Andrew doing good at slipping out of that though. But this is a is a great move that we see for guys to just. Help kind of mobilize the bottom guy. Mouthpiece slipped out, I believe, from Titus here. We're going to keep going. And really good job from Titus working his way up. Working 35 way seconds up. left of the second round here. Oh, good elbow Strong there from Titus. Elbow. Yeah, that second one was a little questionable, but. Andrew doing a great job at making distance here. Oh, good elbow there. Oh, my gosh. Those elbows are vicious from Titus. Ten seconds left here. Andrew's got to find a way in this third round to change the direction Ooh. this fight is going. Up here. Man, what an incredible. I mean, what a really good performance so far from Titus, man. And Sturdivant is fighting hard, man. He, he, he he's is. scrambling out of so many different positions. But man, this is a grueling fight. I mean, it's just about the type of pace. Constant wide hook, looking straight for the takedown every single time. And I mean, he put on some good pressure right there on Sturdivant. But man, so far in the grappling department, man, it has been towards Titus. Yeah, absolutely right. Um, what you, so right now, what are your thoughts on uh, the rounds, man? Who are you giving the rounds to? So, so you know what? I between the two, I've been really impressed with Andrew and his defense on a lot of these. But I'd have to say the first and the, the definitely the first part of the second, I'd have to give to Titus. End of the third, I think Andrew did some things to redeem himself. But this third round's going to decide everything, I think. I really do. Yeah. So it's round number three. And I think Andrew knows what he needs to do in this third he round. He has here. to get the finish. He has to get the finish. Finish or a, I mean, 10-8 type round, man. You got to get a finish or a 10-8 round. For the first time in the fight, we see these guys touch gloves <laughs> in this third round. And uh, these guys just, you know, talk about Warriors going at it. This is what we're seeing right here. Oh, man. Oh, good body kick. So, hey, let's start this uh, third round with exchanging some head kicks here. Wow. 
Wow. Titus doing a great job on setting up his takedowns with those with those head and high, head and high kicks. Andrews, I mean, well, I mean, he's taking these. These are some really aggressive strikes there. And oh man, really good. Andrew aggressive. being on the top end of this grappling exchange. Yes. Oh, he got that. him in the guard. And he's got him heavy against the fence too. Yes. Could make things interesting. Titus, you see, actively going for a higher guard here and settling for a lower one. Oh man, really good job by Sturdivant trying to put his head on the cage and these strikes, but. These strikes are, I mean, they're, they're a little vicious, but I mean, you gotta do something to really like make a difference. You have to get this finish. Yeah, and Titus doing a great job and kind of Titus knows he's setting just up this to punch survive. defense here. Yeah, wrapping up the arms of Andrew, making sure he can minimize the damage here from the bottom. It's really hard to inflict a lot of damage here with these small shots that Andrew is, is oh, those elbows are looking Ooh, good though. That's a good elbow there. As long as Titus has that that right arm, it makes it difficult. Oh, he's Andrew busting him open a little bit more. Oh, he's keep elbowing. You got to get a finish. Titus opened up bad, 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 yeah, bad. Yeah, he's opened up real bad. You see Titus going for this shoulder lock here, looking for the sweep off this. Yes. He's going to try to extend while he's got the shoulder and try oh, to go for the sweep. Oh, man, seat. that's really bloody that right there. That is bad. He has to stay active, man. He has to be aggressive in this guard right now, man. If he doesn't, this is going to be. Yeah, and Andrew's got about two and a half minutes here to, to figure out what he's going to do to finish Titus, and Titus has got two and a half minutes here to to do what he can to survive this this third round but so far it has been an onslaught as Andrews really changed the direction of this round yes he has man and, and that's the thing man I, I think he's down two rounds to none Titus, is, so. Titus just got to survive man yeah and I wouldn't be surprised to see Chris Bowen stand him up not too soon from here man yep I think that might be a good move if, if we don't see any more movement from from either of them Wow, Titus is split open bad. He's split open bad. You gotta be aggressive with your elbow. Take it, boy. Andrew getting a lot of feedback from different directions of this fight. The consensus is Andrew needs to really pick up the aggressiveness here, which is hard to do. These are five long rounds in the third, and Chris Andrew is going to go ahead and stand him up. Oh, time. Minute. Time. Time out. Time out. Look at that cut. Oh my God. That cut is bad, bad, bad. He is leaking, leaking, leaking this boy. Wow, that's getting in his eye. I'm not sure if they're going to let this continue. That is a lot of blood here. There are judges talking. Sorry, ref is talking here. I'm not sure if they're going to let this go on. They're not, they're not able to get that to stop. Titus saying he's okay, but this is a bad, vicious cut. And I think it's coming from two places. We see it dripping from the left eyebrow and the right forehead, right side forehead. And I think they're going to end up calling this one. If they can't get that, if they can't get that under control, we got the medic looking at it right now, and it's it's not looking good for him. And they call the fight. Andrew Sturdivant takes a win. If that's how they end up deciding, and this is not how you want to take a win, it's definitely not how you want to take a loss, but. We know sometimes this happens. We have the cut men in there looking at him. But this cut might just be too bad. It is bleeding bad, bad, bad on both eyebrows, it looks like. Andrew looking just as disappointed as Titus is here. Hey, boy, that was, um, wow. Yeah, that's, uh, nobody wants to see a win or a loss coming from uh, something like a cut. You know, you had mentioned. That you, cut was gonna be vital as the fight went on. And, and you had end. mentioned one of the Diaz brothers before this fight, and that's an issue that they've been having too. Yes. With the past few fights, you know, over time, you develop some scar tissue in that uh, eyebrow region. This could be the issue with Titus that, you know, you just get cut up so much from there that it makes those cuts even easier. 
and I think ultimately they're gonna end up calling this and uh, we'll see how they make the decision, but that's very unfortunate. That is I very was looking forward to seeing how this fight was gonna end. Me too. Man. Yeah, they're calling that stoppage by doctor's order. Oh, wow, wow, wow. And you know, you gotta feel bad for a guy like Titus because Titus was winning that fight. Titus was winning the fight. I mean, just be straight up honest with you, man. And uh, Yeah, I think there was no – I agree with you 100%, Finney. I, I don't think there was any argument that uh, Titus had the first and second round. The third round really started to look a little bit more towards was. Andrew's side. but I would have given – if the fight would have prolonged like the way they were doing, I think I would have given the fight to uh, Andrew in the third – I mean, the round of the third round to Andrew. Yeah. But um, without, a, without a doubt. Sure. Um, yes, so for sure in that matchup, um, uh, yes, I think Titus Moore did do enough to win the fight, but because of that cut, man, that's a, uh, man. Congratulations to Andrew Sturm on a pro debut, not the way you wanted it, though. Ladies and gentlemen, at three minutes and 20 seconds into round number three, our cage side doctor has brought a stop to this fight. Your winner, out of the red corner, with his professional debut, Andrew Starboy you expected it. you know that was a grueling fight and you got the win on the doctor stoppage but give me your thoughts what's your thoughts about this entire fight um you know i figured i was gonna come out here hit him with some good stuff walk out of here with a punch on the pad and uh really i thought i was gonna come in here and stand on the feet for the first minute or so you know and then take him down and work my wrestling like i usually do and find the neck and crank a choke out but he was a lot stronger than i thought he'd be so went the way it went because of the strength and uh, it was a lot better than I figured it'd be on the, uh, on the ground. Yeah, man, you look at a fight like this, you know, probably on some of the judges' scorecard, they probably had a 2-0 Titus going into that third. Would you ever think about a potential rematch with Titus on any given chance? Um, yeah, I'd definitely like to, um, you know, that was a shitty way to end things on a doctor stoppage, but you know, I'd like to get back in the gym and get my conditioning better and better before I can come back in here and face anybody, really. All right. Also, anybody you would like to thank, and also, when the next time we're going to see you back in here? Um, I think, what's next? Is January here? January here. Uh, it may be January. It may be, what's it, April? April for sure. You may see me in January back up here at the show, but uh, I'd like to thank, you know, my fans. I got a little fan crowd out there. I got a bunch of people at the church. I want to thank you. I want to thank all my sparring partners, all my training partners. Uh, we had a, we got Chance coming up next. We had Brevin get a big dub. We had Logan and Logan and Lyndon got them a tag team match earlier. They won that. So Agogi's what five and zero already? Five and five and six and all the night. Let's go, Agogi! All right, congratulations on your winner, Andrew Stoudemire.